Hello everyone, so I've just walked into Dollar Tree and I'm actually looking for the hybrid black pens. They work so beautifully, they're so smooth, but I haven't spotted them anywhere. Looks like they have some new notebooks here. Somebody was shopping. They're all lined. So they have some more notebooks along the top as well, composition books. I wanted to take a look at the stickers, so I see some new ones. They're really pretty. They're dimensional, but they're a hard sticker, almost like an enamel. And they have these as well. This mermaid collection is new. I feel like, yeah, these are all fairly new. So it looks like they have some new banners. Oh, these are the zebra pens, and they're usually in the stationery with the other pens. Lots of new stickers. These have puffy stickers. They have like a, a variety of puffy and regular stickers. They're really nice kits and they almost have like a puffy felt um, fabric feel. It's hard to explain. They're not like a plastic. These kits are cute too. So if you're doing a Disney themed craft, these little booklets would come in handy. I don't know if you can see the puffiness and the difference on the stickers. I think we've seen the little flags out before. Looks like they're back. And they're stitched. They're really well done. Cute. These little animals are puffy and holographic. Very, very nice. The stickers falling behind me. This one's a cute set too if you want to make a card. The one thing I really appreciate about Dollar Tree is they carry a great variety of Crayola, at least at the Dollar Trees I shop at. Does your Dollar Tree carry Crayola as well, coloring products? I think this LOL coloring book is new. They have a lot of books as well, and children's books, novels. Is this a show, Super Wild? I think it is. Let's see, they have some novels here. I've seen these, their new Disney collection, oh boy. And I keep thinking they're night lights, but they're actually pencil sharpeners. So there's the variety of Disney ones. Typically you see Mickey, but I don't remember seeing Ariel before. If you have a Mickey fan, they have a whole bunch of things here, like a notebook and folders. You can put the sharpener. You can put together a really nice Disney themed package using Dollar Tree items. Of great options here of Crayola, but see they have the pip, squ pip squeaks, which goes nicely with a coloring book. One of my favorite containers or baskets is using this as a gift basket base. I just it it holds everything so beautifully, and because it's angled on the back end, it works as a great support. Just a few days ago, there were so many beautiful, beautiful velvet little gift boxes are all gone completely cleared out i should go take a look at the bags and see if there's anything new i think this is a new birthday bag i haven't seen them before eh, maybe the unicorn i have but i didn't see the cat those are glittery they're really beautiful 
there's I think baby Yoda and Mickey so again look up high because sometimes that's where the good bags are I think we've seen oh I think we've seen all these so maybe not the little and lovely you know, welcome baby it's glittery We'll take a look back here and see if there's anything new. These come with two in a pack. These are three. And I feel like they used to have four of the small bonus packs sometimes, but I haven't seen them in forever. Great selection of streamers here and confetti. So these are, there's different little birthday cakes, a variety. Gorgeous boxes. I have to say, I really do like their boxes. Depending on what gift I'm putting together, sometimes they work as a really good base and then you can cellophane it with and just make it look really pretty. These are amazing. I love them on birthday cakes. I really do. They just make it so fun. Has anyone tried these? Lots of banners here. Party de decorative decorating supplies cute little headband i thought this one was like the happy new year one i just spotted but and then they have the foiled balloons which i love these ones you have to blow up with a straw but you can do like 2024 for new years and not spend a fortune and still have a cute effect hanging on your wall you know these are beautiful i don't think i saw these they must have been late to the christmas line right I do not remember seeing them. I saw these really large ones, but not with the stripes. I love the silver one. Like, look how nice this is. It's like a matted, it's so pretty. I recently purchased a box similar to this, a little different detailing, and made a beautiful birthday presentation little overview of the puzzles. I feel like some of them are new. I haven't seen some of them. And then we'll go down the, I guess like a toy aisle, kids aisle, I call this. They have the Ryan's World little mystery packs. Crayola, Mickey again. So always nice to walk around and then you can piece things together and put together a beautiful gift on a budget. You just have to take a little time just to go through the aisles. I don't know what these are. They're surprise little wishkins. They're surprised I've never heard of them. Oh, I thought this was the actual, um, there was one by, oh, I forget the brand. This is new. Has anyone played it? Is it noisy? Is it super noisy? Oh, I love the new tattoos that are out. Like, how cute are these? Dollar Tree now has a lot of pretend play things too, like you can see. And they keep getting better. Look at this. So many little outfits for Barbie. They fit Barbie, right? They even have... Oh, here's like another Crayola item. I think these were out last year and then sold. The little houses, people can paint them and turn them into gingerbread house decor. Quick peek at the vases and such. These are kind of newer. Uh, nothing else that's really standing out. They have all the wreath forms if you're starting to prepare anything for spring or summer. I know, we're, we haven't even gotten through winter here, but it's good to look forward to some warm weather too. It hasn't, it's been pretty mild here. Where, where you are, how's the weather? So I feel like some of these are newer prints, but for the most part, we've already seen these. I've shared them a few times on the channel. All the Christmas leftovers are on clearance at 50% off, which is fantastic. These are little metal 
may have lots of floral picks anything that you're thinking if you need to make a wreath next year it's a good time to just put them in a little container and then pull them out next year at half the price these bows are so pretty you can even decorate gifts with them with really nice ribbon anyways this is what's super exciting they have all their valentine's day items out so we will go through them i'll share all the wonderful things that they have here and um yeah hopefully we have a good view at uh, what's coming beautiful gift bags i did spot some kind of scattered through yesterday at the other dollar tree look at these aren't they so sweet their little hats oh my gosh this one's holding a little heart they have the little metal tins lots of boxes gorgeous gift bags different sizes of course and they also have these little shaker plates so it looks like this is a bit of a off pink and or pink very light pink and then red almost looks clear Hard to tell. they do have a nice selection to make a gift basket you can even use this bowl as a base these cups are a bit thin they don't feel super solid and there are these beautiful boxes you can put a gift together in them or just add roses as a display these would look cute with those conversation hearts, I think they're called, or the little red, I forget, they're like hot hearts. They're spicy, I think. I forget what their name, what they're called. The wreath's are really pretty, and you can add a ton of things to them. They have all these extra pieces here. Really nice. These ones are really pretty, actually. Check this out. So beautiful. I love the matted look. They have pom-poms, some flat wreaths, a little bit easier. The signs are these so fun. If you have a little display or a kiddo who likes to play, they come with the little flags. Oh, these are massive. Oh, they're beautiful. Look, the glittery hat. These are actually really well done. So they are total kind of tabletop decor of the conversation hearts and then the little booths just so sweet i'm i keep looking at them wondering could i use them i love the little dangly flag so these are like little barn Houses, they have pretty sentiments on them. There are different colors depending on your style. Little picks, you can put these in some flower, like a flower arrangement. I actually really like this wood. It just, it, it feels so natural. And then they have cling stickers. You can put these on mirrors as well. They stick well. My daughter sticks them to her mirror. These are new stickers. I have never seen them. They had similar layouts last year, but not quite these ones. I also have some confetti or sequins, which is good for shaker pockets if you're making. They actually have some, a lot of new stickers. I feel like something like this was out last year. These are cute. And then they have these that are actually little shaker stickers because there's, do you see the little sequins in them? So well done. The hearts are really pretty. And then they have the little cupcakes, etc. They have stamp stickers. A bunch of die cuts. This is a really nice table scattered box. So there are hearts in here and then little round almost like diamonds and little pebbles. Oh, I know some of you really like finding the molds. So just an overlook here of the full wall. And then I think I'm gonna just take you down the Christmas stuff because there are a few things here. These are really pretty actually. You can attach it to a gift um, next year, right? Look at these. And this fabric, I'm wondering what I can do with it. Even like 
wrap a gift with it. I think it's fun and cute. I love these stockings. I actually really like the mini ones to put a gift card in them. And I customize them, so I think I'm going to grab a little package because you can't beat that. So many gift bags left over this year. This is the first time I've actually... In the past, it's been like a couple pegs here and there, but there's just so much stuff to choose from. They even have sprinkles. If you're looking to make cupcakes for Valentine's, you might as well, may as well buy it now. Actually, it would be nice if I could find, see if they have that print with the cute gingerbread. Yes, I'm going to grab this because I use it in paper crafts. This display already has a few of the new spring-summer floral picks. And there are actually new ones this year. So some of them we didn't see in previous years. And I'm going to share with you one pick here specifically. It's just, see this? So beautiful. It's hard to share, but it's kind of got like a textured. It's a different type of flower from the traditional ones that we see. Lots of Ioni. It's kind of scattered some stores keep their product together and then others don't this is the black glue and then they also have these which i noticed are like an eyeliner gloss lash glue and it's black and then they have clear these are cute towels right shaped into little puppies some new product that i haven't seen before is product like this these ones are all new packaging to me i've never noticed them before This is super glittery. I feel like this Dollar Tree has way more variety than some of the other ones I go to. Some have like a lot of stock, but I don't feel like they have as much variety. And this one just has a whole bunch of things I've never seen before. Look at this. A makeup brush cleaning tub. I've never seen this. It's quite large too. These little makeup reusable white like cloths they actually work really well my daughter has a little pink one and i've washed it a million times and it works and these were part of the christmas line these little pumps work so my daughter put some product of hers in here and they work they have a little pump at the top she's happy with it lots of nails some nail kits that I've never seen before some really pretty prints and almost like a spring line some nail glue You know what? I don't always come across these, so I'm going to grab one more for my daughter. There's some nail things here if you're looking for a pedicure. No new prints yet for spring or summer, I don't think. I don't see anything. These actually look pretty decent. Some of them sometimes look like they're falling apart. They look really thready. I was hoping to find a couple more winter snowflake plates down this aisle because they're on clearance and I was like maybe somebody left a couple over here but it looks pretty bare of any Christmas things. If these were on clearance because they're the red and the green lid I would buy them just for hot chocolate or candy or stuff like that for Christmas time. Cookies looks cute. They have a good selection here of wreath forms so i'm on the hunt for a birthday bag that i actually it was this style long must be from this line anyways it had a beautiful large balloon and it looked glittered but not like that loose glitter and it was in a previous video and when i was kind of looking at the footage i'm like oh my gosh how did i miss that
bring to your attention these tissue paper packages come with 20 and this one here comes with 35 sheets so i think that's a great value and a really nice assortment of colors i always have tissue paper on hand at home and this type here only comes with three sheets but it isn't paper it's like a plastic so I was just looking for something to do for New Year's Eve and maybe adding some sparklers to the to a dessert or something. But I'm not quite sure. And they have these little horns. Make some noise. That's not a bad package because the New Year's ones I think come with a smaller amount. These are cute for stirring drinks. Table scatter. Cute little stars for New Year's. It's not very common to find stickers here in the bridal section. That looks like you can make a cute card out of these. I like the headband because it's metal. It's really nice. And they have some cute baby bags. And these are new to me. I haven't seen them before. So it looks like you can put pictures in them and make a cute gift out of it. But I'm not sure how it opens. Is there... I don't know. I thought this was wood, but it's not. It's just a print. So I know I've been sharing with you some of these because now look, they have silver. So for a while it was just the gold. Now they have the silver. I'm actually hoping to find two more of those little tiny tea light holders, but it looks like they're all sold out as well. But they have these. These weren't available everywhere. They're cute. Being a sticker fan, I always bought new stickers at Dollar Tree. So these are all new. They're really well done. Looks like a floral print. I was hoping to see if they had some of that those Christmas bubble mailers if they were on sale but nope they didn't have anything in the Christmas section either if you like stationary supplies Dollar Tree has a really great selection and then they have these here I'm not sure if you're starting a budget for the new year maybe you want to save some money or track your expenses these are a great way to do that if you're kind of like a hand pen to paper i should say i guess but i'll put this away pen to paper type person and uh i find sometimes it's easier to see things on paper rather than digital because if you write it in digital it kind of just disappears from your mind these are so cute they're actually like a faux leather bound and they're just really nice. These are like the travel notebooks. Just can't get over how cute they are. If they can encourage writing or yeah, just so well done. Little panda I think is the sweetest. I'm still hoping to find, I think they're made by Promax and they're a hybrid pen similar to this, but I haven't had any luck finding them. These ones work really well actually. My daughter has one and it's smooth. I used her pen to write a note and I was impressed. These are cute, aren't they? So not too long ago I was here and they had a whole bunch of button shirts. They're all sold. I'm actually surprised. I'm actually surprised. You just never know. And they have some of these bags. I'm wondering if the totes are actually on clearance with the Christmas print. They're really nice reusable gift bags. Somebody's lost their hat. Should bring it to the front. So 
Someone was asking me just to share some of the drinks. These are, I think, power drinks, and then they have energy drinks and regular pop and stuff like that. So they have Brio and Dad's. This here is like a drink cocktail mix, which runs for about four to six dollars, I would say. Four to six dollars at the grocery store. They have some snack foods, but it looks like a lot of stuff is kind of cleared out, maybe just because it's the holidays. It looks a little bare compared to normal. They have Pringles, they have these nuts. I actually really like them. I think they're so tasty. They have the crispy shell on the outside of the nut. They're tasty. I'm gonna grab another pack. In the noodle section they have, oh, they also have Aurora sun-dried tomatoes. Well, they're not in oil, they're completely just dried pieces. So they have Mr. Noodles, beef, chicken, Thai, veggie. I've used uh, the lasagna noodles along the bottom here. They work really well. They also have all your dry pastas and zalentos. And in the baking section, you'll see Betty Crocker. They have the spice cake, jellos. Pistachio is really hard to find at the grocery store, so I'm always surprised that Dollar Tree has it. So down the toiletry aisle, I just wanted to share with you, these here are really popular, but they're satin, they're like a polyester, they aren't actually silk, right? So they have pillowcases as well, so just be mindful of that. And then they have scrubbing bath mitts, looks like some of their stuff from the Valentine's line. They also have these are Faith in Nature, and they're sold, I think, at Walmart. They're just body washes, and there are different smells. This is cute. It's like a butterfly shape with little dangles. I wonder if it actually holds your hair. <laughs> it's really cute. These are sweet looking too. These are like the velvety look. Lots of headbands, hair accessories. These are made by Scoonsy, which is a pretty big line. They have eye candy stuff here as well. Anyways, I think I'm about to head to the checkout, but I was even thinking to use these in a paper craft, but I'll think about that and how I would use it and manipulate it. And everything that's Christmas is 50% off. I'm not sure if other stores are offering better, but 50% is better than nothing right now. And tissue paper, gift bags, anything that you might need. So the little bows are also part of clearance. I wouldn't have thought that, but I like this gold. I guess more people wrap this year or are less gift giving because there are so many gift bags left. The spring floral looks to be making its appearance. A few items here, bows if you need them. If you're looking to put together gifts to send away. So I think Valentine's is transferring over here. And probably by tomorrow, everything will be changed out. These are Laura's sea cord, and they're the mini, mini eggs. Tootsie Roll, bunch of pops. Do you like Tootsie Roll lollipops? So the little mini Christmas trees are also 50% off. The lights, I'm gonna grab a couple of the white lights because mine always seem to kind of burn out when it's closer to Christmas day, and then I need a little emergency light. And then I'm gonna look to see if there's any wood here or sequins. They have the wreaths. Lots of wreaths here as well, wreath forms, I should say. And another quick look at all the gift bags. I was actually hoping to find some dessert plates with the snow print, with the snowflakes, but they don't have any more. So I'm gonna grab this placemat. Could make a pillow or use it for fabric. This is interesting. What is it? Oh, it just flipped upside backwards. Cute little stickers here. 
them. I feel like these are new. Has anyone tried adding pink to these or even Sharpie marker? Does it work? This Dollar Tree in particular always has a wonderful selection of coloring books. Not all the, not all the Dollar Trees I visit have the same selection. How about with you? Wow, I don't think I've ever seen live, live edge wood. These planks are beautiful. They have the rectangular shape and then they also have some oval ones. So pretty. And how cute are these little hearts? Perfect for Valentine's Day decor. You can paint them or stain them. They're really pretty. Lots of tube confetti. And these little glass bead kits. How pretty is this pink for Valentine's Day to do something with it? And they have little birdhouses some new crafting cords such pretty it's like a velvet these are all glass knobs so if you're needing to change your office desk you want to upgrade the knob so beautiful such little pearls pearl beads but yeah how wonderful the selection is this they also have these little glass jars with rhinestones in them and they have a variety of colors some tools here in the craft section foam adhesives lots of stickers as well and stamps you'll find some stamps oh these are new i think they are I've never noticed these before. These little pearls, well, they're half pearls. They're perfect as accent stickers if you're doing a layout. Every once in a while, I like to check out the socks. And look, they have some new trouser socks. I hadn't seen these before. And they have the navy blue and the black. And they actually feel really nice. Do these chamois actually work? Do they soak up a lot of water? I don't really like the fabric feel on these microfiber towels. I don't have a kitty, but these do look like new packages to me. And they have a cream filling and I'm not sure what the brand is. So maybe someone who does know if it's a good one, if it's a good brand. I know I've heard of Fancy Feast, and they have Fancy Feast here as well. And Temptations. So there are a few drops here and there of Valentine's Day things throughout the store. But I'm sure, like I was saying, they've already started flipping the front. I thought I saw a birthday um, gift bag that was like glittered balloons when I was actually going through one of my footage pieces I'm like oh that's a really pretty bag but I can't find it here these are really nice too but it was at this store it must have sold already I'll have to keep an eye out on a next visit to a different store this is a new bag too it's extra wide bottom so for a bigger or wider gift extra wide bottom of the bag, I guess. Oh, so pretty. Quick overview of some of the birthday slash congratulations decor, because of course it's a mix of things, right? This is for, this would be cute for New Year's to decorate like with some balloons. I'm wondering if I'd need a few more strands of it. Pretty candles. 
What's the effect that you call this? These are metallic. They're so nice. You will see that Dollar Tree is starting to put out their spring things. So these are part of the spring line. And I'm really impressed because they've made gift tags out of them. So look at this. It's already perforated. You just detach it and attach the little gift tag. I was just at home since and I spotted this teacup party and some other cute puzzles and I thought, does Dollar Tree have something similar? I'm always knocking things over. And I swear I'd seen teacups before. I'm afraid I'm going to take down this whole place so it's really well stocked. Next time when there's a bit less on the shelf, maybe I'll go through it. I feel like they have some new things here in the kids section. I don't remember seeing these. They actually feel pretty good, like good quality. They don't feel super cheapy. These are cute. They're minis with the little road signs. All they need is one of those little mats now. You know the car mat? Oh, and if your kid's doing any of those little projects, these come in handy. I love the round container up top. I know it's a really thin plastic, but it holds so many markers. I use it in my craft room. I actually have all my Sharpie notes. I think that's what they're called. I haven't seen any hearts yet, not for a very long time. And they're about this size here. I always forget there's like a cute name for these, but the fabric squares are so great here at Dollar Tree and they really do keep up with some trends. Right now they have flannel and they also have some cotton ones, which we'll go through. They're near the yarn. But just to share with you some of the pieces here. The eyelash yarn, I really like this as well. Great if you're into paper crafting. You can use all sorts of little things to make embellishments. Oh, I should actually look to see if they have some cute pink, delicate, like this stuff. It almost looks like a linen, but a nice salmon pink. Even maybe softer than this for Valentine's would be nice, but this is not the stuff I'm looking for because it's a different material. This is Isla, um, lash glue, so it's clear, and then they also have the black. Lots of eyelashes made by Ioni as well, and I know some of you have said really good things about their eyelashes. If anyone has any reviews, please share them down in the comments below. I feel like this is new. Under eye concealer, and it's made by the BPR. Line. I don't think I've seen this before. So newer things are popping up. These are all new nail polishes, lots of neutrals. It's like a coffee color. Caramel almost. More peachy side almost like my nail polish right now. Eyeshadows, eyeliners, mascara. Lip oil roller. This one's mint, actually. I like mint. This is some more stuff from the Be Pure line, and I've seen these before. I just don't know if they work well. My favorite nail file. Oh, this looks like the Sally Hansen stuff.
Has anyone tried this liquid lipstick made by Ioni? Is it sticky? How cute are these? I wonder if there's a game you can play with these erasers. This is a fantastic find if you're traveling. They just have all the little essentials and gorgeous bags. And they do have all the Christmas items on clearance at 50% off. If you're looking to make pillows next year, these work really well. They're placemats, but they're dual layered, so easy to stuff. And I've shared how to do that on the channel before. I don't even think I saw these over the weeks. Or maybe we did. They have a little nutcracker candles. I guess they didn't sell well. So now they're on clearance. And these too. I might grab these. These are beautiful as well. Even if you put them together as part of a gift. Just really nice. They have silver, gold, and white. And they have so many gift boxes still left, which are good for clothing. I'm going to grab a couple of these packages. They're really nice cookie boxes, but there's a specific print I would like from here. The stockings are on clearance. Cards. I know many of you were searching for cards and couldn't even find them throughout the season. So the store here has so many left on sale these are lovely boxes for just regular birthday gifts as well and just to let you know these are variety packs so they have a different assortment of cards this is actually a pretty good value at half price because there's three colors great for shaker pockets or shaker embellishments these are cute too. They almost have like a faux stitch on them. Nice glittery ribbon. They have all of this decorative mesh, which is made, which is perfect for making wreaths. I'm not sure that this is a very good value. There are so many box cards here. And the thing is, these are really great for Christmas in July as well. So if you want to just have a little fun and send out a cute, you know, card in the mail, you can do the Christmas in July theme. And on the upper shelves, they also have these cards. Really pretty and lots of the snow globes. If you want to stage the little snow globes, you can use these mini trees, put them inside. This ornament filler, which you can also add in the snow globe, but I use them for shaker embellishments. These are cute. You can add them on the top of the snow globe. I actually like having the fabric bags for wine bottles especially traveling in the car it just prevents it from I feel better having them in the fabric and they have simple ones the candy canes are still available and lots of boxes lots of boxes lots of gift bags ornament baubles they have a ton of them as well if you're making a wreath these come in handy and then they have lots of ornaments still these little trees are cute. Some items to decorate for New Year's. So they have the banner and there's three banners in here, which is, I think, really cool. And then the New Year's headband. Look at all the new stickers. I haven't seen these anywhere else. Now, it's not really my style of sticker. But for those who really enjoy this, what's, what is this called? This, there's a name for this type of sticker, right? Some positive sentiments here.
What do you like storing in these containers? There's a variety of colors, which is nice. Lots of glue. The pegboard system is kicking around still. Lots of sticker packs. So these you can separate because there's sheets in them and you can use them as party favors. Kids tend to like little stickers or if you can do a activity with them. The staples here, I'm not really seeing much. Only the room spray was kind of new the last couple weeks. Has anyone tried it? They have these beautiful soaps, by the way, which run about 10 to $15 online. And they smell nice. I think they smell nice. And this is a really nice line of cocoa butter. I think it's called Palmer's. And uh, but the thing is, the bottle's really tiny. Has anyone tried these soaps? There's two in a pack, and they smell pretty nice. I actually really like the Jello lemon pie filling. I make little mini tarts or even a lemon meringue pie. Do you like lemon meringue pie? I have lots of treats here as well. And Dollar Tree has S cookies. Don't forget that they have the chocolate and the plain. And I love the plain ones. I haven't tried the chocolate. If you have, maybe let me know if they're just as good as the original. These boxes have, are available at most of the Dollar Trees I've been to. So they're just a flat bottom shell. Now they are hard. Question for you, do you like hard shell or soft shell for your tacos? Have you been organizing, decluttering, purging for the new year or the lead up into the new year? Typically Dollar Tree carries some new stuff now this time of year. So if you need anything, it's a good time to find them. Lots of aluminum here as well for baking. I should say for baking and cooking. I always like checking out the little toys in the... My Bear Bear, he's super gentle with his toys. He doesn't rip them apart. I know some of you have said that your doggos will just rip through them. Cute scarves for the little ones. Um... These are cat toys, but yeah, how do your toys, how do some of the toys from Dollar Tree hold up for you? Are your dogs gentle? Some of them have flashlights, which is awesome. I feel like they carry almost more products for the, for cats than they do for dogs. Maybe it's just me, but like they have so much more variety for kitties. I still keep looking for gel glue and oh my gosh, it's been years, probably four years now that I haven't been able to find it. It's so weird to me. Is this a new product at Dollar Tree? I've never seen this before. No, it's not something I typically look at, but it's a removable picture frame system. And I know that that's pretty pricey if you buy it probably by command. Which they have also command brand here, but I'm wondering if that would have held up. I frequently change the leg pads, the bottom of my chairs with these, and they work really well. I've never had a problem. There's command here. These are metal. So it was just at a different Dollar Tree and I feel like they had way more selection of makeup, things I hadn't seen before, but this one's not so bad either. They do have the things I typically see, I think. The other one had just so much more different packaging. This is Ioni. If anyone has any feedback on any of the Ioni products, 
let us know. It just helps quite a bit because then we can try things if somebody else has had a good experience. It just helps so much. This looks like new stuff to me. See, this is an eyelash eyeliner glue. And they have the Ioni eyelashes. I know these you guys have said work really well, those who have tried them. Has anyone tried these for a pedicure? They're soft, they're rubbery feel, like a texture. Lots of different craft items here. So these come in a little glass jar so you can reuse them. This is really high, I'm gonna just bring it down. So there's a variety of glass beads. Yeah, just seed beads in here and they're all in tubes. And then they have these glass dropper bottles are actually really nice. What have you used them for? I love these picks. I use them all the time in my craft room. Anytime I need like little details or to pick something, poke a little pun, like, you know, if you do a die cut and it's not cooperating, I just use that and it pushes it through. I like these. If you're just starting out with paper crafts, these are great little kits because there's a variety of paper in them. These kits are great too, so you can use the stamps. You know the clear acrylic stamps on them? You can use sentiments and just personalize them. These are really pretty. I haven't seen them in the hair accessories. These look like they're kind of new. I wouldn't say the value is great though. There's only four pieces in a pack. These are so similar to the things you would find at Michael's and pay, you know, $8.99 for. So I always find stuff like that is a great value. These pieces are too thick to cut with a Cricut Maker, right? They have a little decor for mushrooms. So if you're doing something for spring, like minis, you know what I mean? Miniatures, miniature fairyland or something like that, garden. You can paint those and then cover them with the, with an acrylic or a sealant, a Mod Podge, a waterproof Mod Podge too. They have a, I have one that's dishwasher and water safe. I get, have these water brushes, has anyone tried them and do they work well? These are shipping labels and they're stickers, but you can also use them to make your own DIY stickers. Cute sticky notes, I actually like the print. I've been eyeing this note organizer for probably a year now and I look at it and I'm like, I really like it. I just wish I had a little bit more blank space these are new. Oh, these are cute. I like that it doesn't have lines. See, totally up. This is exactly what I like. Just the little plain boxes. And they're different covers. Yep, I love this. Although I don't need a planner necessarily, but these are really well done. See, this one has too many lines for me. I like the plain one better. Do these actually work well as a mouse pad? Because that's what they're supposed to be. Does the mouse register nicely on top of it? I feel like there's some new product here, especially gel pens. Like this here I've never seen before. They're solid on the outside, the color. Usually they're see-through, right? 
This pen works really nice. My daughter has it and I tried it and it was smooth. These are pretty and they're fine tip. I'm over here looking at Valentine's Day things and these stood out to me. I just love the look and I need one for my craft room. Sometimes when you're just moving glitter or something, dusting it away, you just want a pretty brush. Oh goodness. So I don't know, should I get gold or the pink? Pink candle or gold? These are also new. This is what caught my attention was all the nail polish. So I thought I'd share with you all the beautiful nail polishes that they have here.